scale of 1 to 10, how excited are you about life right now? Probably an 8. Uh, describe yourself in a hashtag. In a hashtag. That's social media. I don't do social media. So maybe boring with social media uh, or hashtag no social media. If you could coach any other sport besides baseball, since you used to coach baseball, what would it be? Probably hockey. If your life was a musical, what would Marquis say? My life was a musical. Well, I have not seen a musical in my life. Let's see. Take me out to the ball game. Uh, what's one thing people don't know about you? Um, that I love to grill. What's your wake-up ritual? My wake-up ritual is just get up, jump in the shower, get some clothes on and go. I don't eat breakfast in the morning. What's your go-to-bed ritual? Yeah, I don't, don't really have one. Just when it's time to put the head on the pillow, you go put the head on the pillow. Uh, what's your favorite time of day? The evening. Where'd you go to college? Missouri State. Uh, your dream country to visit? I don't really have one. I don't care to leave the country. Um, what's the biggest surprise you've had? Um, yeah, that's a good question. I, I'm, I'm not quite sure um, what that one would be. I, I, don't, I don't know if I've had a big surprise thrown at me. Uh, spring or fall season of sports? Well, being in this position, I like them all, but I do love fall weather. When I was with baseball, I love fall baseball. Would you prefer vintage or new stuff? Probably new. Um, who is your favorite celebrity? Uh, um, how about Jennifer Aniston? <laughs> who has been your biggest role model? My dad. What are three things you can't live without? Uh, my wife and my two boys. What's your one ingredient you put in everything? Yeah, I don't put a um, ton in. I love ketchup and I love cheese. Uh, what three people, living or dead, would you like to eat dinner with? Um, I would have loved to have had dinner with Ronald Reagan, Jackie Robinson, and um, Craig Berube, who's the head coach of the St. Louis Blues. What's your biggest fear in life? Speaking in front of a bunch of people. Window or aisle seat? Window. Uh, what's your current TV obsession? Yeah, I don't watch a lot of regular TV. It would be more either NHL Network or MLB Network. I watch a lot of games. Uh, who's your favorite team other than the Jaguars? Um, well, I'm a St. Louis hockey, or St. Louis Blues, a St. Louis Cardinals fan, and then probably the teams my, my boys play on. Uh, what is your secret talent, if you have one? My secret talent? Not that talented. I can probably, I can hit a golf ball from my knees about 200 yards. Uh, what is the most adventurous thing you've ever done in your life? Not much. Didn't do much adventurous. Um, how would you define yourself in three words? Three words, probably simple, um, loyal, and honest. What is your favorite piece of clothing you own? Anything with DAC athletics on it. Biggest life lesson you teach or used to teach your players and now any other athletes um, be on time to everything and do your job every day. What's uh, superpower you look for? To fly. What's inspiring you in life right now? Um, probably my kids. Just enjoy them getting older and seeing where they're going. What is the best piece of advice you've received? Um, the best piece of advice was probably from my grandfather when I was engaged. He told. Mary Ellen and I to never go to bed mad at one another. And we've 27 years, we've tried to do that. And if we did, it was her fault. <laughs> What's the best piece of advice you would give your teenage self? Don't be an idiot. A uh, book that everyone should read. Yeah, I don't know if I'm capable of doing I don't read a lot of books, so I'm not sure I give advice on that one. Uh, what would you like to be remembered for? Um, a good father, a good husband, and a good coach. How do you define success? Yeah, doing the best you can every day. It's, it's not always about the scoreboard. It's giving everything you have and, and uh, getting after it every day. What do you love most about being the athletic director? Seeing young women and young men just grow up. You see their pictures when they first get here and they're young kids and then they grow up and they're young adults. Uh, what is the best way to rest? On a beach. 
favorite memory as the athletic director? Um, probably day one of the job. If your life were a song, what would the title be? Again, I'm not a musical pro Lucky man. Um, if you could master one instrument, what would it be? The drums. If you were to get a different job outside of sports, what would it be? Professional poker player. Dogs or cats? Dogs. What's your spirit animal? My spirit animal. Turtle. Uh, what's the best gift you've ever received? The best gift was probably the golf bag my former players got for me this past year. Very nice. What's the best gift you've ever given? <laughs> uh, we had a couple's night one uh, holiday and I got fake lottery tickets and the gentleman thought he won $20,000. Uh, what's your favorite board game? Scrabble. What's your favorite color? Gray. What's your least favorite color? Brown. Sunflower seeds or peanuts? Sunflower seeds. Uh, St. Louis Cardinals or Chicago Cubs? St. Louis Cardinals. Do you like non-conference games or conference games more? Conference games. Do you like coffee or tea more? Neither. What's the weirdest word in the English language? Discombobulated. Do you like dark or milk chocolate more? Yes, like all chocolate. The stairs or an elevator? Stairs. For summer or winter? Summer. Uh, you are stuck on an island. You can pick one food to eat forever without getting tired of it. What would you eat? Emo's pizza. A dessert you don't like? Pumpkin pie. A skill you're working on mastering? Hitting a golf ball straight. What's the best thing to happen to you today? Um, our athletic department got approved for our travel budget for the school year. What's the worst thing to happen to you? The visa bills came for our athletic department. Uh, what's the best compliment you've ever received? Um, that's a tough one. Professionally, coaching, it was probably complimenting how your team played or parents would say thank you after two years of their kid being here. And then personally, it's probably somebody complimenting your kids. Um, what's your favorite smell? Cigar smell. Uh, McDonald's or Burger King? Um, depends on the meal. McDonald's. If you made a documentary, what would it be about? Probably coaches, umpires, and players and the interaction over the years and stories about that. Sweet or savory? Sweet. Uh, a song you can listen to on repeat? Um, don't Stop Believing. If you could switch lives with someone for a day, who would it be? I wouldn't. What are you most excited about at this time in your life? Um, really seeing my kids, where they're going to go with their lives. What is your go-to for having a good laugh? Ron White. Uh, use one word to describe Danville Area Community College Athletics. Competitive. <laughs>